now, young product managers. If you don't have any product, if you don't have any experience, you still have one product that you can lead, and that is your CV. I recently saw a webinar where the topic was your CV, the product manager's first product. While that wasn't exactly the topic of the webinar, like not literally, it was more of um, how to go through the recruitment process, the title itself was very intriguing and got me thinking and it well led to this video. So let's assume that you are really someone who's just passionate about product management and yet has not had the opportunity to be one, to be a product manager. Why would you consider your CV a product? Well, applying the mindset, applying the skills that I teach in the course that are fundamental to product manager to your CV can be really eye-opening and beneficial. After all, CV stands for who you are. It's supposed to represent you. It's your it's your silent voice of representation. This is your lawyer talking to recruiters when you're not around. So if it's a CV of a product manager then that's already have the success. If you can prove to someone on a piece of paper that you've got what it takes, despite having the right experience, then you already have some kind of success ahead of you. So if you are able to show that you are a product manager just by drafting the CV in the right way, since it's representing you, you are its full owner, full manager, you are the one person responsible for the content and the result that this content brings. And it's the content that's supposed to be the eye catcher for the recruiters. So if you are not sure what works best, you can always A-B test it, prepare a few versions of the CV and then send it to different positions and see what works. Obviously, just a reminder, you always need to adjust your CV to the offer you're applying to so it matches as much as possible. However, you can still try to see if different templates work best, different fonts, maybe you can choose different wordings, different stories. There's lots of variables in a CV and while I usually guide people on how to put the right content, how to use the right words to best describe themselves as product manager. I don't really feel like an expert in making it look beautiful. And I would try different things when I would be back on the job market, hopefully not anytime soon. But also, you will be iterating the CV. As time goes along, you need to grow it, you need to change it, you need to adapt it to the job market, to your skill set, and to put the right weights on what's really important. If you are, for the longest time, a senior developer that was given some product management duties, you will have to change your CV to reflect the product experience in order to land a product career. If you focus on technical skills and the technical improvements you made in the product as a developer, that will not go anywhere. And you have to be wary of that. This is your one KPI, one, your one key result that's connected to the CV. To land the job as a product manager, nothing else matters. I mean, okay, not land. This is the ultimate goal. Your key result here is to get the invite to interview. That's the CV's purpose. From there, you're on your own and no paper will represent you. But also, as a passionate product manager of your CV, you can invest time in research. 
see the current trends, look for new templates, see what was successful for other people that you can replicate. You can talk to other successful candidates to see how their CV looks like and if you can take something out of it. Sort of like um, pitching their competitors for ideas. This was a bit of an inspiration to think about your CV as a product while being a product manager. Maybe not with the right experience yet, but if you want to become one, you have to think like one. You have to act like one and your CV is the perfect product to start with. Thank you. See you in the next video. Thank you for making it to the end of the video. I really hope you liked it. And if you want to see more, be sure to like and subscribe those buttons below. But apart from that, I'm also running a product management course on Udemy, which is crafted for aspiring and young product managers, as well as the more senior ones that are looking for more of an inspiration and where to grow their skills when they feel lost. So if you want to check it out, there's a link in the description and hit me up if you want a discount coupon. I'm really happy to share it. Thank you. See you in the next video.